I've seen a few pairs of like underwear. I've seen a couple of tattoos on a butt cheek. Oh, which is like, whoa, there it is. Okay, cool, thanks. incredibly excited for the new Thor movie, Thor Love and Thunder, and with that, there's of course a promotional tour that a lot of the cast members are a part of, doing interviews along the way, and Chris Hemsworth currently is doing his set of interviews, and along the way, we've seen some really interesting insight to this film and what we can expect from the future. So we want to take a closer look at a recent interview that he did with BBC One, where he did spill some details on the upcoming movie, and it does seem seem really exciting. For instance, Chris Hemsworth currently is in the run for having the role of the longest superhero. That's something really impressive. It's, it's only six years I've come this far, you know, it, to turn back now would just be a waste. So you've just got to you've got to <laughs> hope that he doesn't do a cameo in Deadpool 3. Now currently the record apparently is set by Logan or Wolverine who's been playing the character all the way through the Logan standalone film. However, Marvel trivia question for you guys, there's one more actor that technically beats out both Logan and also Thor. Leave your guesses on who this is in the comments down below and stick around to the end of the video to find out if you're correct because you may have noticed or caught on already. Now, of course, another massive part of playing this character is keeping in peak physical condition for the role. And especially with Thor's character arc that he went through since Avengers Endgame, it is gonna be interesting to see what they did and how they chose to tell the story. Also, Chris Hemsworth talked a lot about getting into peak physical condition during quarantine, and I would just use the extra time to really get in shape. It was like me in lockdown for six, seven months, and I was just like, what else to do but train and eat and train and eat, and you know, it's just my sort of prison mentality. <laughs> and I grew and grew and grew. Real quick, if you're not following us on Instagram already, make sure you do check out the link in the description down below. We upload some pretty interesting content over there and you don't want to miss out. Now, a lot of fans are really excited about this film because Taika Waititi is once again directing the project, much like he did with Thor Ragnarok, which was pretty universally loved across the board. Now, it is awesome to get the chance to hear Chris Hemsworth talk a little bit about Taika Waititi's involvement in the movie making process and just the way he handles a lot of the props and things that he asks for when creating the film. And then off you go and it's like, how do we assemble this into a, a film? <laughs> it was- well, uh, All the toys. Yeah, exactly. Uh, that's, how, <laughs> that's how he would uh, storyboard, you know, a bunch of action figures and you're over here and you're over here and you do this. Look, it was just him at his kind of wackiest and most insane in a beautiful, beautiful way trying and experimenting and exploring all sorts of ideas and concepts. Okay, real quick, if you haven't guessed the Marvel trivia question already, the correct answer is Tobey Maguire. Technically, when he came back to Spider-Man in 2021, meant that he held the record for the longest character returning after a certain amount of time of 19 years for the Marvel Cinematic Universe. I guess also the Marvel Universe. Though there's been other instances of heroes returning for some sort of cameo appearance after a long period of time, like the original Hulk, or there was a Wonder Woman cameo appearance that happened recently. But yeah, it is significant to mention Tobey Maguire here as well. Nonetheless, the new Thor Love and Thunder film is looking like it's going to be a really good time, and fans are really excited to see how this movie ends up turning out. So what do you guys think of this new film? Are you excited to see how it takes shape? Let us know in the comments down below. Make sure you subscribe your notifications on for more videos like this. That's it for today though. We'll see you guys all next time with a brand new video. Bye.